Hello friends, my name is Alea of Cozy Crochet Co. I show you how to crochet the cozy way. And in today's video, I'm going to be sharing with you what I got for Christmas as a fiber artist. And I'm not here to brag or anything, but if you're as nosy as I am, I want to know what everybody got for Christmas so I can either add it to my list for next time or I'll just buy it myself. So if you are interested in something like that, make sure you stay for the rest of the video. Also, if you like yarn and crochet content, make sure you subscribe to my channel. Also, like this video and I want to know down in the comments, what did you get for Christmas that was your favorite fiber arts wise or not fiber arts wise? I want to know from you in the comments. Also, don't forget to follow me on Instagram. I will be hosting an Instagram giveaway later on in January. So if you want to enter into that, make sure you're following me on Instagram so you'll be the first one to enter. And if you want to support the channel, buy me a coffee the link will be down below in the description box it helps the channel and you get a shout out in the next video all right so with all that out of the way let's get into the video so right here beside me i have just a bag of everything i put it in one bag so i can do this video we are fresh off of christmas the holidays christmas parties everything and I just had to do this video like so that I can play with my stuff. So I'm just going to be digging into the bag and picking like the first thing that I um, get. This is in no particular order. But the first thing, and I'm so excited about this. Y'all know I love starting new stuff. Um, I got this drop spindle. Now I saw this drop spindle on Etsy. And when my husband asked me what I want for Christmas, I wanted to try to get something different than just yarn so i requested this beautiful drop spindle and i will link all the links to everything down below so if you're interested in any of these um you can check them out yourself but look how gorgeous this detail is i am super excited i don't know how to spin yarn but that is something that i want to do in 2024 so just look how gorgeous and the finish on it is absolutely to die for like it's just so gorgeous um i don't know what else to say about it other than it's a drop spindle i am gonna be honest i don't know how to store this because i'm scared that it might break so let me know down in the comments how do you, if you have a drop spindle or if you spin your own yarn how do i store this like do i store it upright i know like once yarn is in yarn is on it it'll probably be like more cushy but just look at the details it makes me feel so fancy like how gorgeous is that so since i showed y'all the drop spindle i might as well show you the roving yarn i don't know what this is but i got this yarn way now i tried to look on etsy to see like the name of it in the seller but the listing's gone so um all i know is oh it's from busy bee fibers Oh, I don't know if you can see that. It's from Busy Bee Fibers. It's in the color sandstone, and this is eight ounces. I have no idea how much yarn that's going to make. I know nothing about spinning yarn. I just know this color is absolutely gorgeous. Maybe I'll find like a like a a similar color, but this was just absolutely gorgeous. Oh my gosh! This is the first time I'm opening this up, and it is absolutely so soft. Um, I don't know. I don't want to mess it up, but this is what the color looks like. So this is what the color looks like. How gorgeous is that? And it is just absolutely beautiful. I am super excited to go on my yarn spinning journey and buy different i've heard these called so many different colors let me know in the description i mean let me know in the comments down below what do you call these because i've heard them called rolex yard um art bats roving i don't know um but i'm super excited and and i will definitely be doing a video on me doing and experiencing spinning for the first time because i am so excited to go on that journey so make sure you subscribe for some spinning content so the next gift is technically a gift that i bought myself but with my husband's credit card <laughs> and it's going to be the cordsmith oh this color is pretty in the lights and stuff on on camera but it's like a darker green like without the camera 
<laughs> I guess. But um, it's a 3D printed handle and it has three latch hooks on it. And it's used to make eye cords, which is super exciting. Um, I don't knit. So the only eye cord that I could do is like the crochet eye cord that takes absolutely forever. And it's not like the same knitted eye cord that um, you would normally see. And like you can always get the eye cord little crank machines, but like you have to, it's really complicated. So when I saw this on Instagram, on a viral Instagram post, I had to have it. Now the Instagram profile that sells these is called Size Inclusive Collective. And she sells it through her Instagram. She doesn't have a website or anything, which is fine. Um, she is a one woman show, so I will link her Instagram down below if you want to get one of these. Let her know that Alea sent you. And these retail for $25, and it's like $5 shipping. And I think the more you buy, the more discount you get. I just got one because I wanted to try it out. And I wanted to do a review on it, and I've been just playing with it and having so much fun. So if you're interested in this guy, I will link it down, but link her Instagram down below. But yeah, you have to buy it through her Instagram, and it, she's a one-woman show. She 3D prints them, glues them together, everything, and um, so you have to be really patient with her. I think mine took about three weeks to get to me, which it came just in time for christmas so if you're excited for me to review this let me know down in the comment section below because i'm not gonna lie when i saw this i was like oh i have to have it and this was my favorite gift to myself all right so you know christmas is not official until you got some furls crochet hooks i'm super excited i've never had so many furls new furls crochet hooks in my hand before I'm super excited to show you what I got. Okay, so so I'm just going to get into it and be unboxing these. I kind of mixed them up, so I don't know. <laughs> but let's see what's in box number one. <gasps> oh my goodness. Ooh. So these are the metal streamline crochet hooks. I think they're aluminum. Ooh. Oh my goodness. Look at her. Oh, so pretty. And look at the head. Oh my goodness. These are absolutely gorgeous. And so for Christmas, I asked for a lot of them. Um, so this is the five millimeter. And holding in my hand, it feels amazing. It feels really like nice and weighted and kind of expensive but i got them during black friday so i did get a discount i was talking to somebody on one of my videos about these or one of my community posts about these and how she said that they're different from the um odyssey hook so let me grab one of those all right so i have uh i've got an odyssey hook and i have another streamline i tried to get okay i do see a bit of a difference this is what they look like compared to each other so you can see like the difference in them so and i haven't used these yet i literally am this is the first time i'm unboxing them um but i do see a difference in them and i'm excited to use them and see like how they work and if i like them i i'm pretty sure i will like them <laughs> um but i might do like um comparison to all three of the different styles that i have um because it is different but in like a good way because it's not it's not the same as the odyssey um hook and it's a little bit different than the streamline just a tad bit so i might do a video so make sure you look out for that me comparing them but while you guys are waiting for that oh if you get the the metal uh streamline hooks you do get a polishing cloth now i got quite a few of them and they only gave me one cloth which is weird but i'm not gonna complain <laughs> um so we have a size five and a half i mean sorry we have a h hook all right let's open the next one we have a four which is a g hook these just glisten so pretty. See that bling, 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 bling. <laughs> oh my goodness, it's so nice. Now I will say just having it in my hand for, you do find fingerprints. So if you're trying to like photograph these, you will have to polish them up, shine them up. So I got the G hook, the H hook. I got the six millimeter J hook. Oh my goodness, it's so pretty. And they're so heavy. L hook seven millimeter l hook gorgeous 
you can hear them right they like clean together eight millimeter m hook so i got all i got all of the hooks that i normally use so four from a four millimeter to eight millimeter gorgeous they are like unreal oh my goodness and it's like these are nice and heavy and expensive feeling oh my goodness i think i would have gotten the whole set but i had a budget <laughs> <laughs> but yeah these are nice oh my goodness so i can't wait to do a full review on these um the only thing that i can think of right now that would be like like a drawback is them clanking around in my like project bag so i gotta figure out a way or where i'm gonna display these where no one's gonna touch them <laughs> so the last two hooks that i got they did this thing um i think it was like on a certain date they were like hey we're about to come up with a mystery hook if you order the hook now without seeing it, you get like 20 or I think it was like 30% off or 20% off of the hook, right? During Black Friday, like the Black Friday season. And then they were like, but if you wait until Tuesday, then you get the hook for 15% off. And so I was like, me being the picky person I am, I was like, I'm going to wait until Tuesday to figure out what the hook looks like before I spend my money. And I wish I would have got it on discount because I would have loved this. Oh my goodness, this is so pretty. I forgot what they called this. I think this is like the Midnight Hook. Let me check. So these are the Moonlight Streamline Crochet Hooks. Ooh. Okay, I'm looking at mine and mine has like, I don't, I, you probably will not be able to see this. Let me see if I can. I don't know if you guys will be able to see this, but it looks like something is like a cloud or something is like, floating in my hook oh you won't be able to see this because of all the glitter that's not cute there's like two visibly clear imperfections in this hook ew once again this is the first time i'm looking at these hooks but uh, i don't know i had to contact somebody but i got the 12 millimeter in this hook it's a gorgeous hook absolutely pretty 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 um i love the thought and color concept of this hook so i got it in a 12 millimeter and i got it in a 15 millimeter so i got the bigger two and these are just absolutely gorgeous they look so mystical and like i'm surprised they didn't drop these like around like halloween or something they are absolutely gorgeous besides these imperfections i'm trying not to nitpick but i know i'm going to be looking at it the whole time i'm crocheting first of all i never had a 15 millimeter crochet hook so i had to grab it in this like limited edition style how pretty so let me know down below did you catch this drop and because these are gorgeous these just are pretty so yeah that's all i got for christmas as a fiber artist i want to know down below in the comments what did you get for christmas i am super excited to hear from you yeah that's gonna be it for today's video i hope you have a wonderful day a wonderful christmas and a happy holiday and i will talk to you next time and remember create something gorgeous bye guys